my uh, fellow Americans, it's time to finish up Lies of P today, which is both exciting and very sad because this is truly a one of a kind game. And dare I say, on the level of like a Bloodborne spiritual successor, I'm pretty sure I also heard that they are already planning DLC, which is always extremely hype because you know they go crazy on bosses, especially when you're this inspired by FromSoft. You know you gotta bring it for the DLC, or else it's not worth it. So previously we beat up Alexasia. Also, really want to say thank you for the support on this series throughout all the likes and comments are what you know keep a series going to the very end so just thank you so much and also thank you for checking out the Mythimu merch link is in the description a whole catalog full of cool designs if you haven't checked that out yet you can feel free to do that but now enough chit chat it's time to get into this so strap yourselves and grab yourself a little snack some water and without further ado let's begin So there are a few more things we can talk to here. There a lot of sad shit happened last time too, man. Like, I actually cried. <laughs> it's like a tiny bit. Ah, the hotel seems truly empty. Now that Lady Antonia yeah, that's the thing. That's actually a real departed. thing. Even if you don't go and she talk to him, just the presence. I had, you know? All that with my parents happened when I was just a child. These halls are truly cavernous now without her and her music. She was a terrific pianist before she fell ill. Now it's up to us to protect this hotel. Hell yeah. Her home and ours. Losing someone never gets easier. Very true. Don't make me do it already. Man, this place is actually filled with very kind people. My favorite type of people. Memory of beach. Not the theme I want, but I'll listen. So the wonderful gentleman who gave my precious time back to me. That time I met you was light itself. Whether you are that child or not, I think you are a kind, precious child. Thank you for giving my joy back to me in my last moments. To the young gentleman who resembles Carlo. Antonio Sarasani. So they're trying to get that child back. And Carlo is also the guy who wrote Pinocchio in the first place. What a way to change the story and pay homage in a grand way. All right, let's listen to this real quick. This is beautiful. I mean, I'm not going to play it all for you here, but you can go check it out yourself if you want. You feel warmth inside. Yes, I do. I'm not even exaggerating. This being part of the OST could make this game have one of my favorite OSTs of all time. A lot of games have like, you know, two or three bangers that you just remember the game for. And then in other cases, you have a game like Chrono Trigger, Shadow of the Colossus, to just have the entire thing be a fucking masterpiece. Also, we can go here now. I think this is the guy. He said he was going to go to Rosa Isabel Street. So maybe we can see if he's starting his new life. Is he just on the street over here? Not up here either. This is the perfect place because there's nothing here. There he is. Hello. Nice to see you again. It's nice over there. I thought if I got a second chance, I'd go to where my heart's content. Yeah, do that. I never expected to get out alive. Oh, it's overwhelming, even now. You deserve it, though. Want to take a look at what I have? I grabbed a couple of things before taking off. It's a new life, a new attitude, and simple pleasures like ordinary conversation. Nice loot, yeah? If you need anything, just say the word. All right. A carcass crystal X. That's sick. Buy that. Buy this as well. And buy this as well. The white lady's hunting apparel. By the reason for coming here. I used to be a fan of the actress Patricia. Not... The red actress Adelina, but her sister. Oh, Patricia had an angelic oh. voice like her sister. If she'd become famous, they would have called her the White Goddess. <laughs> we killed her. Uh, Sorry about that. Her career was cut short. She took poison and ruined her throat. Mm. Uh, I've only read others' memories, so I, I don't know the details, but the memories people had of her songs. You should have heard her voice in her prime. Something transcendent like that it makes you feel alive. I survived. So I'm seeking out experiences like that. So, any more questions? That's really nice, actually. It's nice to know that she had a fan or two about what he saw. Did I go sightseeing? You bet I did. It's the heart of Kratz. Oh, I the thought you meant like before, the but... <laughs> There's so much to see. Although, most of it has burned down now, I suppose. Hmm. The most fascinating thing, I couldn't believe it. The writing on the back of a maid puppet. Oh? I read memories, but still, any way you look at it, it's the maid puppet's words. Probably designed like that. What kind of puppet would write that stuff? Still, it was weird. You should see it for yourself. I want to. What are you talking about? So maid puppets, the, we can see the bag of it though. Oh, now we can. I love you, June.
the hit us with it. I mean, we knew, but you get confirmation like that is sad, but also very cute. They didn't even have to elaborate on any of this, but they did with this fella. Even these little fellas got closure, and they deserve it. There's still so much to unpack here. So there's a red fox needs to finish up that little storyline. We're gonna try saving Sophia, Geppetto somewhere here, and Simon's here. Like, how is this gonna go down? It's still quite a lot of things, but let's check it out. Oh, take a weapon away. Maybe it's a talk boss fight. Oh, <gasps> a real body? Um... I don't really want to just stab you or something like that, but... Maybe I should, because fucking hell. Beautiful. The music too. Yeah, but like not what will you do? constrained. You have to decide. You, not me. Well, why not you though? Alive, perhaps against her wishes, or, or give her peace. Fuck's sake, man! It's your call. I wanted to live and be happy. I don't know what happens if you let her live. For oh, I'm gonna give her peace. Thank you. I was trapped for so long. So much torment. So much pain. Take my ergo. I will be with you to the very end. Can I implement you into a puppet or something and you can live with a different body but still alive and happy? It's not how I want to spend my night, man. Sadness. You feel warmth. Well, that's good at least. The Shadow Flower. I don't think this is the song either, but this one sounds beautiful. I think of you while waiting in the rain. Take me away as I'm exhausted in the dark. Shadow Flower. The tears of the blue fairy locked in the glass bird cage. Yeah, that's gonna slap ass, that song. My blue fairy. This is making me feel something. We did do the right thing. Didn't we? I hope I so. Trust you. Let's keep going. Mm hmm. <laughs> a true power was the ability to move time. Can we just move time to a time where everything was nicer and then prevent shit from happening? Half moonstone. Just that in here. I wonder why that exactly. Now we're not gonna hear her voice again, though. Or maybe she's in Ergo, but like, the fuck, man. This game has it all. <laughs> you bitch. What? Get out of here, man. Ow, ow, ow. What the hell? Uh, 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 uh. Don't jump it. The other side now. What the fuck is up with you guys? And bum bum bum. Then you step, 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 and then bum bum. Bam. That is a healthy one, this one. Okay, I'm getting fucking burned alive. Bop, bop, dodge, bop, bam, nope. And boom, stab, nope. Anyone else want to jump me from behind a wall or some shit? All right, we still have a little way to go. I thought it was going to be like back-to-back -back bosses, but I'm glad there's a little bit more. I have a bittersweet feeling inside me right now. This doesn't happen very often in video games at all, but I've really invested myself in this game for the past like week or so. Hi. I another one of you. Bomb, 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 boom. Ouch. Give me a quartz. Come on. I need a quartz. Just one. Yes, baby. Bam, bam. The literal only bad thing about my current weapon is this heavy. 
to hit all that, or well, the last one to get the knock, instead of just being able to, like, one swing. Other than that, it's, like, the perfect weapon for me. It also nailed the feel of this area, though. They started out with, like, oh, this is the epic music. We're leading up to the tower. We're climbing it. Blah, 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 blah. And now, after what happened there, it's just this somber track leading up to the final boss. Now, I'm assuming Simon right now is collecting all this shit here, all the ergo, and he's gonna use it against us. Maybe he's just gonna become Manus from Dark Souls 1. All right, I'm pretty much ready. Let me use all my ergo things, and we're gonna get in there. Some health and some damage. There we go. Still kind of sad I didn't get to see the weapon we got from, uh, like, Sasha there. But, I mean, it's probably just her weapon, right? But also, I would love to just have that. I'm so sad Sophia's gone now. I hope to hear her voice just one more time in fucking Ergo Paths. All right, let's get the staggerable window up. Auto charge pulse when discharged. Yes. Should we change hair? Nah. We'll stay with it. Actually, we'll change fit for this final fight here. The white ladies? Yes. Also, while we're here, let's listen to Shadow Flower. Number one, you feel warmth. We've been feeling a lot of warmth here recently, which is nice. Ah, uh, it's, it's time. As much as I'd love to just sit here and listen to the music, it is time to finish up the game. I just hope Red Fox isn't just dead on the floor up there or Simon kills her in front of us or something, man. Because Black Cat and her, I really like. Oh, she's here and she's safe. Yo. Ciao, Bello. I had a feeling you were no ordinary kid, but I never expected to meet you here. It's a trivial matter. Everything is trivial in this part of the business. Reward or no reward. The reason for kidnapping someone or for blocking your path here. Don't block my path here, man. But if some audacious behavior helps my brother see again, that's a different But I, I left I left him. You guys can in go, man. Honesty, I don't want to fight. Good. Not you, at any rate. For one, it's a damned hassle. True. And why should I go out of my way to satisfy an employer who didn't pay me enough? True. It's not too late. <gasps> we don't have to fight. Let's fucking go. Just show me some kindness. I will. And I might change my mind. Good. I think this is exciting because we followed along with it here. Give it. Thank you. This much? It might even cure him entirely. Yay. It's not fair. The way I've been harassing you. There we go. You're the only one who's ever been kind to us. And that's I why it's understandable. My life is I a like stalker you. that your father is safe. My employer promised not to harm him. Go on then. Go to him. Geppetto's waiting. Yeah, but I don't think your employer <laughs> cares much about anything, yeah? But yes, we did it. I'm very happy about that. Also, Black Cat Mask has an internal device that supports fading eyesight. Before the boy had lost his sight, closed his eyes for the last time, he thought of how he had lied that he was her lost younger brother and how much he wished that it had been the truth. That is so cute, though, but also sad. I, they, It is now, like, they're family. But we always had the question there, because it seemed weird why she was, you know, royalty and he wasn't. But I don't think she cares, and I think she she knows. Mask of the aristocrats, craft of the sophistication and refinement. After turning her back on her house, her sole interest was her younger brother she had found on the streets. She had sensed the boy's guilt long before, but she accepted him as her sole family. Beautiful. All right. I never even if only we oh wait, your name's Claudia. Oh sh shit, I but skipped I that. it wasn't possible. We were both protecting something, yep. and those things weren't compatible. That's the thing with all we this. Didn't fit together. Hurry, please. Go to your family. I love you, Red Fox. I love you both. I'm really glad we got that finished up as well. I was actually expecting us to be dead. <gasps> He's here. Wait, just meeting you first? I mean, Simon knows about this, surely. Been watching us the entire time. It saddens me to see my precious son. <laughs> Look how old like you've this. gotten. I wanted you to grow up as a good boy. In a peaceful world. Yep, that's what all parents yeah. should hope for their kids. I think all I've taught you is blood and violence. Pretty much, though. This will be the last time I ask. I promise. Simon has gone completely mad. He's trying to become a god by using a tremendous amount of ergo. I don't know what kind of world he wants to build. Perhaps there's no stopping him. I trust you, my son, and I'm ready for any outcome. But I don't know what you think of okay. me. Okay, interesting. We get this now. Truthfully, for my sake. If all he's told us so far has been the truth, was I a trustworthy father to you? It's a situation where we're born in this world, so what else could he do? Kind of thing. Could he have done about it better? Probably, but I'm gonna say yes. I see. 
I have the courage to carry on because of you. Cute. Put an end to it all. And come back to your father's side. I'm sure you're not playing Remember me though. the happy family we once were. We can become that again. I wonder if we do actually remember the past like that. Alright. We use the key. Wait, we're still not done. We need to get a shortcut up there. Assassin's amulet. Incre <gasps> I've been asking for this shit. Instead of the stamina region, I want to put this on. Okay, I think I can feel the damage already. Holy shit, we do fucking quick damage. Crit is so strong. But like, what other things can crit? Isn't this the only thing I have that can crit? Other than, of course, the grindstone that can give everything crit. But like, the pistol rock drill also has crit. And the trident has crit. I didn't even see that. And it's time. Alright. So we're fighting in the middle of the whole thing. And yeah, Simon's gonna be like, ah, oh, I'm gonna use all this Ergo against you. And I'm still gonna fucking whoop his ass. <laughs> One star fragment, thanks. How many do I have? I have 90. All right, let's see what you got. Did you feel that? It's like someone walked across my grave. What? I sense air go everywhere. I mean, this place is saturated with it. Like what you'd expect from a mountain of dead puppets. Yup. So what would happen afterwards? Like, was it just like, oh, we freed the world. Everyone goes back to normal and no more puppet frenzy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can feel the different damage. This is fucked up. Just tanking in a row. Get a quad from that easiest guy of all time, actually. It's looking me lots of items. I thought we were just going to walk in there and that's it. We still have time to go. <laughs> Crits have become so overpowered now. And I love it. Oh, church. Hand. It's Manus. Listen, my brothers and sisters. I, Pistris, shall tell you about a true eternal life. An angel's gift was once something humans dare not enjoy. Many humans died with hope in their hearts and the ones who lived harbored rage instead of death. Eventually, humans destroyed and burnt their hope on their own. That is how the angel became the god torn to death. But today, there are definitely those who survived with the blessing. They, the immortal ones, still walk around and wish for the resurrection of God. I clearly told the truth a witness. Now you shall all follow this path. Alright, now it's for real. <laughs> I can see it this time. Oh, hold on. Simon Manus's confession. A father is like God to his son. Even I, Simon, was no different in my youth, but the one who created me was no normal human, and my abilities were extraordinary. You were created? You were a failure too, the ability to read minds. Being abandoned in front of God meant the world's destruction. From then on, my life existed to make a world without lies. A world where no one betrays you and there's only truth, even if it's forced. Now the finale is here. Once the door is open, it can't be closed. For humankind, I, Simon, gave up being human and decided to walk the path of immortality and the truth. My body will be broken and reformed as the god that was torn apart. I leave this record in my last moments as a human. Simon Pistris Manus. While the Nini lost his parents at birth and was ruined by all this shit, he went on a path to better the world so that would never happen to anyone else. At the same time, Simon is kinda doing the same, but obviously in a much more fucked up backwards way, but the parallel is there. And it's always the parallel between a hero and a villain. I th it's, that's like a saying with the two. I Actually get some more stamina and it's time. Let's do this shit. Manus. Let's see it then. We finished up everyone else. So it's just you left. We just stood there looking like a fuck. It's actually Manus. Oh yeah, you're malformed as shit. Do you regret your decision or is this the right step for you, buddy? You're not looking too good. So handsome as well before. He's like a hunchback too. I guess. Distilled immortality and a key that opens a world with no lies. A key that unlocks true evolution. Evolution right here, fellas. This is what we're going to look like in 20 years. Give thanks. There goes a gift from me. Simon Manus, who will transgress even God. What a design, though. Bow down to your God, who will be born now. 
Look at him. All right, Manus. Let's see what you've got, Bakaru. Because I've got big damage and crits. Arm of God, it's here. This motherfucker skipped every day of no not. Nope. Is it a uh, big explosion? Like that, okay. Nice. He's so telegraphed. It stays for a long time, too. Uh, uh, uh. Bop. I'm just going behind you. Dodge. Okay, you, you just miss. Okay, if I just go that again and then try to go for a dodge or parry, then I should be fine, too. Ow, I was going to do no hit run, man. How dare you? I mean, clearly it's going to have two faces at least this. Bum. Bum, bum. Oh, this music slaps, though. The next evolution is coming. Nope. Bum. This is like the easiest guy to dodge I've ever seen, man. Stab. And bum. Stab. Bum. Bum. Stab. Bum. Bum. Nope. Fuck. Nope. Alright. Did not mean to press that. Bum. 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 Nope. Nope. Alright. Heal up. Should have maybe waited a little bit, but here we go. Yeah, he has a lot of time to, like, regain his shit, so... This is, like, the best weapon for it. Just run away from this. I got that without even healing. Boom. Whoa. Uh, quick. If I just hit that man, he would have been dead. God damn it. Uh, Alright, let's see what you've got then. Your next step. Silly goose. It's not. You're looking like a fucking freak. I'm sorry. Behold, as I discard this fragile body. Uh, okay. Witness me as I grasp the power of a true god. You should've just made yourself a puppet that was strong, man. Like, Victor was onto something even cooler than this. What the fuck are you? Oh. Hold on. Oh, no. I didn't see the faces on you either. What the fuck? So this is gonna be, like, sticking- Isn't this a penis head? This is a penis head. Look at that. What a cool design, man. I was just in... Ergo. Okay. The true arm of God. I'm just letting this happen. So cool, man. You've been granted so much power. Let's see if you're even strong. This looks so much like a uh, new Lord of the Fallen type boss. This the design is so sick. Here it is. Awakened God. Hey, you shoot like that? <laughs> Look at you run. You're weird. Dodge. Bomb. Oh, oh, nice. Okay, not nice. Already done more damage than you did before. Uh, dodge. And nope. And nope. Do you do more? No, you don't. Okay. Oh, shit. Yeah, I can't see you, man. I did fuck up a lot, so... I guess that sucks for me, but... What is this? What is this? Should I just be hitting you? Oh, I could just have be hitting you there. Oh, okay, okay. Elden, fuck. We do lose that. What? Also, disruption. Not good for me. Bum, bum, bum. Nope. Buff up. What? I, I never know when you're gonna do shit. What is this? What is this? What is this? What is this? Go away. I don't know. I could have probably gotten so much damage there. Nope. And... Yeah, I need to just know the timing because I can't see him. Bop. Bop, 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 bop. You're coming down to reach and grab my... Eh! I was just cheating. Like, uh, how was I supposed to know that that was gonna happen? Alright, we could probably done that first try. Unless they have caused to a third phase. I don't know yet. Dodge. Bomb, bomb. Bomb, bomb. Bomb, bomb. Oh, that didn't hit me? Good. 
We just crit like almost every hit. Nerp. Bop. Nerp. Bop. Bop. Bum. Bum. Heal up. Heal up. Boop. Nerp. And... Nerp. You miss again. Bum. 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 Goof up. Boom. 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 I'm hitting you so much so often that I feel like I need to get my thing here. Ah. Uh. 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 Damn it. I want to not get hit. Bop. 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 This is like the fucking easiest first phase of all time right there. But it's so fun because it's just so telegraphed. And bum. I haven't done this one move yet. I God damn it. Now you do it the second I see it. Bum. Bum. Dodge. Bum. Bum. Dodge. Bum. Bum. There we go. Yeah, just one heal and let's go. I'm going to instantly pop this. And you're going to do what? Yeah, that's... You can't do that at the same time. Do that. All right, and then run. Go. Bomb. 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 Ouch. Bomb. I could have gotten so many hits, but it's fine. I thought you staggered. That's not stagger. Having the hundred percent crit with this new shit. That, that's what I thought you were doing the entire time, and then I just... Ah, oh, fuck you. Nope. Boom. What the fuck was that shit? Uh, 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 uh. And Bob, nerp. Okay, what is what is this? What do, I don't know. It's just shooty. Bum 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 bum. Oh, you do no damage with this, so I should just get away. Buff up again. Bum. Nerp. Keep giving the wrong. What happens? Is that does that mean it's there? Oh, it's like I see. And it's. It's just a big range. It's not like it's gonna be an entire arena. Good. I hear things in the background which I don't like. There we go. I went for it in hopes that maybe... Eesh! Nope. Oh, I just heal up both. No! Okay, just get away. Run far away. I need you to get over here. It's so cool that I just don't want to be hit by it. Bop. Nope. Nope. Uh. Get away from that. Oh, that must be a third phase, right? This is pretty easy. Oh. Got the parry. Let's fucking go. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, bum, bum. We got the heal bag as well. Pretty much just don't... <laughs> don't do that, is what I'm saying. Nope. Oh, shit. Die, that, that, that. Yeah, don't be by that. Dodge all this. He's gonna come for me. Dodge. Ow. Bum, bum. Oh, let's see. Ow. Is it the end? There we go. Third phase. We got it. We did it. Okay. That is like a real FromSoft final boss that's not as hard as the previous one. It's so enjoyable though, and it has the spectacle that's good enough. Haha, <laughs> Manus. So, it comes to this. Yep. The Blue Fairy. Sophia. Yeah, what do you think? You're gonna imprison her and then think she's gonna pick you? Both. I think if you didn't imprison her... I'm glad you've calmed Sophia, down a little bit. What have you done to her? I'm gonna say it. Liberated her from this or gave her peace? I gave her peace. Say that. Yes. I suppose that was her wish. Yep. Sophia was always wise beyond her years. How old was she? Also, that was a lot of Knowing shit. The truth of people's minds is a curse. Can imagine so, yeah, sounds like fucking ass. Just some gross prick, aren't you? These hands never could. It's fine if I'm gone. But be warned. 
if you want. Watch out. Ah, uh, there it is. Okay, yeah. I mean, we've been kind of on that for a long time. I'm excited to see where that goes now. The Arm of God, obtained after defeating Manus. It's a mysterious relic that the alchemists treated as a sacred object. The alchemists believed that there was once a god who was ripped to shreds, trying to give immortal life to the humans he so loved, and they wanted to revive him. However, the god who was so deep in sleep never answered their prayers. Not sure what this is gonna do now, but I wanna go back and talk to Geppetto. Hope he doesn't backstab me. The thing is, though, now that Sophia's that, do I even care about anything? Now I care about Vanini. That's she the thing, really though. And the boys back at the hotel, but... A god? Terrifying. Very terrifying. But a puppet becoming a human? Now you have my attention. <laughs> Suit yourself, but sounds fun to me. I wonder I what wonder. kind of choice we'll get here. What'll happen now? That's what I'm saying right now. I sure don't know. But I do know one thing. You're stuck with me. And I'm stuck with you, pal. Yeah, have you learned enough Wouldn't about your past, though? Way. Because you were mentioned once in one of the flashbacks there with Carlo Romeo and all that there. So, I don't know if you're satisfied. Oh, there he is. That's... Um, why does this look like a boss fight? <laughs> Let's see what's going on. I knew you could do it. We have all the ingredients we need. Oh boy, this is uh, you're sounding way too I've crazy now. This day for so long. The moment you'd come back to life, you can be human again. That's what he wants. Okay, that his thing goal is just reviving his son. Supply of ergo and the arm of God. I just need the final ingredient, the one that holds your memories and your. But will that mean back? we lose this version your of us heart. and take back the human form? If right, because that's not us heart, like we are now. All the Trials and tribulations will be over. You have been a brilliant and a good boy. As your reward, I shall turn you into a real boy. Give me your heart, son. Um, well, give I refuse. <sighs> I said we were gonna go with it all the time. It's just. It doesn't really matter, because we're going to see them all. So, you know, I'm going to refuse, because I don't really like the idea of it. I believed you were a good boy. We're not going to fight your pedo, are we? You insist on breaking my heart. Well, I suppose Carlo was mischievous. Yep. It seems you inherited his personality instead of his memories. Oh. Well, isn't that what you but want, though? always looks after his children. I mean, I guess... Even naughty ones that must be punished. Like you. Hey, no. In my own way, I grew to love you. Yeah, in your own After way. After all, you're the puppet. Oh, there it is. Who would bring my son back to Got life. Got this vibe from, like, episode one as well. You know, it's like, hey, son, that isn't my real son that I don't really care about, but you'll bring back my real son, real son. Which is, like, it's understandable, but the fact that we are so human is, uh, strange. I didn't mean for this to happen. If this means getting an extra boss fight, though, then I chose right, because holy shit. You were a good boy. Unless Vanini's just gonna come and be like, hey, pop, shoot him in the face. If you refuse... Ah, there I'll it is. I jokingly said that, but it's just true. Uh My son. Oh, you're gonna use the corpse of your son? We're just fighting Carlo now. Oh that sword! Well, I need that shit. Oh, I'm glad I chose this. Holy shit. You can become a Nameless puppet. Come to me. Ow. I also went in here with- oh, wait, I went in here with one thing. What the- I have nothing. You cheater. You knew. I didn't expect you to get a boss right here. Bop. Nope. Okay, you're, you're pretty telegraphed. I'm just sucking it right now. Alright, just kill me. Oh, they even spawn you here. Nice. Alright, let's do it. If it's only one face, we can destroy can this. Yeah. Dutch. Dutch. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, bum, bum. Nope. 
Nice. Dutch. Dutch. Buff up. Boom, 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 boom. Because of Carlo's memories within you. Ah, uh, uh. Good shit. Heal up. Nerp. Okay. Oh, that music though. They did me, 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 me in the background. Get that shit. Step. See my damage? What the hell? Wait, did you just. You healed! You can't do that. That's my shit. My freedom is mine. Bop. You know, there's a point to be made both here because. If I was created solely for that, then you should have made me just a puppet puppet with no, like, thing, right? Like a robot. You gonna heal again or what? Bum. Nope. Shit. Oh, oh. Oh, you're doing the thing I did. Bum, 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 bum. Okay, but spear attacks are so easy to dodge. Okay, okay, wait, chill. Bum, 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 bum. Second phase. Wait. Maybe not second phase. Oh, it's this thing. Oh. Oh shit. What a way to make a simple design fucking cool. Look at it. It looks like wings too. How dare you? Alright, I'll do wielding. Nothing more. Oh, you're going Lady Maria on me? Nope. Okay, that's cool for you. Nope. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, you have that. It's all of them. Good block. Whoa, uh. And nope. Ooh, okay. Okay. Well, should have seen that coming to be honest. Did not mean to use two, but whatever. Good. Bum bum. Bum. Oh yes! Mickey Moo! <laughs> Mickey Moo! Bop. What? Fuck's sake. You never know with those attacks, man, because some of them just track this fuck out of you. Others just kind of hit behind you or whatever. That one I got a parry. Boom, 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 stab. Oh my god, this DPS was crazy. That was bad for me, but it's okay. Dodge that. Bomb, 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 bomb. And. God damn it. And. Narp, narp. Bomb, 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 bomb. Dude, I'm doing really strongly here. And we can just do it without him even healing. Those were some cheeky little dodges we got there. Alright, use this. And... Nope. Damn it. Okay, good. Bomb, 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 bomb. Oh my! Holy mythy move, go on. And... Nope. Yes, yes, yes. Nope, nope, nope. I'm just a parry god now, apparently, for some reason. Alright, he'll do this. Bomb. Block that, just in case. Oh shit, not again. Oh! Even with the length and everything? <laughs> Even with that? Nope. Nope. Okay. Got a few hits there. Bomb, 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 bomb. Okay, we're alive, we're alive. That's all that matters there. Oh no. Yes! Uh, uh, uh. And nope. Dodge. God damn it. I keep fucking it's just half of that up. Good thing I dodged that. Holy shit. Nope. God damn it. I say nope. <laughs> nope. Bomb, 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 bomb. Wait. Whoa. We got it. Bomb. Alright, just go for it. I don't care about uh, how much damage we can get there. I need to make sure I get it. Do this. Boom, boom, boom. What? You're cheating. Uh, 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 uh. Nope. 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 Yeah, I've got that timing down now. As long as you don't one-shot me, I think we're good here. And they oh! What? They can hit on ground? What the? You are dead. Ha ha. Don't have a third face.
Okay, we did it. Holy shit, man. What a fight. Is that my new favorite? Or is the looks... Oh, wait, you... Nah, we're gonna do epic. Oh, who's gonna... Who's it gonna be? Is it Geppetto? It is, isn't it? Ah... <sighs> yeah. It is a very complicated situation. And the thing with it is... Everyone in the entire thing, there's a motive that makes sense to a certain extent. Even though some of them are psychopathic, you can understand it. Oh my... We're just gonna parasite the Maxim right there. <laughs> That's so fucking cool. That was like real anger though, because... Even with what we just heard and stuff, it's still like our father. This version of Carlo that we are. So I, I don't regret my decisions I've made up until this point. I've kind of just done what I felt right at the moment. But I really want to see what... Oh. He's going to realize that Carlo was here the entire time. Yeah. Sorry. Hmm. Honestly, I'm just really happy I picked this because of that fight there. Could have just not gotten that fight at all. So for YouTube, I definitely picked right. You're free. Butterfly effect. That's the interesting part, though. With DLC, they can go any way with it. Because they've introduced kind of a time travel reverse time thing. Oh. I... It's runny. It is. This is exactly what I wanted, actually. I hope she wants it too, of course. Yes. I want to live as a puppet or human or whatever it is you want. She's alive. Oh, she's beautiful. Oh my god. It's a puppet myth. It's a puppet, but... God damn. It's so good to see you. We did it. Reach the ending. Rise of P we got. I am very pleased with my ending. In honor of great writer Carlo Collodi. And we got the song. Just major props to everyone that worked on this. Because fucking hell. <laughs> Makes me proud to be half Korean. Let's see. Is there any after credit scene with this one? Oh, there is. On the crowd experiment. <gasps> you certainly took your time, Paracelsus. Your findings? I think Paracelsus. we have a new brother. A new type of humanity, so to speak. There are many forms of eternal life. It's intriguing. And worth further observation. This Thanks. is... Um, we'll have to get his arm back anyway. I'm counting on it. Expect another report at the next meeting. This voice sounds very familiar also. Paracelsus returning. Ah, and when I return, I will find her. For sure. Another key of ours. Dorothy. Dorothy. Now, what the fuck does any of this mean? What's this? Is this like a Death Note ending? What? Huh? Oh, fuck, did I scare you? <gasps> oh, that's it's the me, setup Hugo. with him. I forgot about you, this Hugo. Oh, that is so fire. nice. I'm going to try to be the Aladoro of a new generation. As long as you don't just act like you are him, actually the, the real one, then owner. it's fine. Check in with me anytime. What a legend, man. I'm happy we got an apprentice rookie guy that survived every arc. Usually they get in way above the head and die. This is good shit right here, though. Alright, let's see here. We can get this. 
Wait, we can even get the sword yes? Oh, fucking worst game all time. Big ass mole. And we can get this sword from the nameless puppet though. That's even cooler. Upon a successful guard, weapon durability is not consumed. Immunity to all attribute status ailments. Ah, increased fable arts damage inflicted on staggered enemies. That can be crazy. People can do some fucked up shit. I really want to see speedruns of this. I'm excited for that. Actually, give me it. Just, I want to see it. Proof of humanity, it's called. It's a scissor blade. It's pretty ironic, considering it was stringed up. Oh, we have the thing. Oh my. Why so much damage at plus zero, man? Seven ho What? Oh, it's because we have crit- Nah, man. If I was able to do a second run, this is the weapon. Because, oh my... Okay, I'm going to upgrade this to plus five right now. I need to do one because of the achievement and shit. Bit sad that actually I get a boss weapon I want to use by the time we're done with the game. It's motivity and technique. This would be the perfect balance fucking weapon here. For new game plus, actually. Buff this up. Can I also buff this up? Right, let's see how much damage we can just get on the heavy now. 1.7. Just normal hit. You can do 700 and more every time you crit with this. This build does require a lot more to work though, because it weighs 20, which is a lot. And you need two scaling things to make it even better. Let me try this. Ah, we have the whole move. That does damage. So if you go Fable Arts damage build in your quartz and amulets, then you're going to be just slaughtering. Oh, wait, that's nice in here. What do we got? The blue bottle. Oh, thank you for giving me a new life. The fact that an ergo puppet can have a second life and become another kind of human requires more time for people to find out about it. Until then, I won't return to the hotel, but plan to stay at this place. The crud disaster has stopped. Still, there is the aftermath of the petrification disease and the puppets. Please heal the wounds for the people. You're the reason we have our freedom. Thank you so much. I'm grateful you freed me from my puppet strings. I can't believe that what I wanted to happen actually happened for her. Same with Antonia, to be honest with you. She got a peaceful end. I thought she was going to die horribly, but we just wanted to fix her up and she got a peaceful end. Even if she died, it was still like she had nice peace at the end. It's sad to see Polendina now though, because it's not the boy we know. But then again, he's going to be shaped the same way if we kind to him. Our entire run, 100%ing it with all we can do, took 23 hours with obviously some AFK time and stuff. If we didn't care about story or anything like that, and if I played it in the way I've played Elden Ring so much now, would have probably only been up towards like 10 hours. That's just so much you can skip, but the fact that it's based on Pinocchio, you have to kind of listen in and see what's going on, and God, I'm glad I did. This might be the best Souls-like like storyline I've ever played. The lore is cool as shit too. Letter of the Eternal. I had a good time. It's amazing to see a new brother being born. I hope to meet you again sometime on the Eternal Line of Time. PP. <laughs> Here's the thing. Maybe you can go and talk to a bunch of NPCs and stuff. I just wouldn't know. I'm not going to go around checking everywhere. I really do feel like I got the best ending in the game. And all that for just following the being nice way. I still have a few things though. I have the hand now and have this apple that I never got to use. You can definitely use that somewhere. And with the records, we've gotten them on side quests and stuff. So I think it's just different answers give different ones. So that would take multiple runs to get them all. But literally right after this, I'm going to be checking out the rest of the OST myself. So um, yeah, I'm going to give you my final thoughts on the game after we check out the endings so let's check out the endings i'm gonna be watching salty's video here with the lies of p all endings and also hold on this comment so this means definitely and dorothy's from wait wait okay oh they're gonna do a fucking that would be sick how many of these stories are free to use now they could definitely do something next even within the same universe right, let's see here this ending is uh real boy you go to him and you just probably say hello this is it so you give heart you need to have the option here what? I believe in you. You are the greatest puppet I ever made. Thanks. We can be happy now. Thanks to you. Alright, I wanna see what happens. Thank you. You are such a good boy. Here we go. Then Medini comes and steps in both. <laughs> I don't like that smile. That's the thing though. It would have gone like this had you chosen that, even with the regret afterwards. Whether that regret was, I'm sorry for not being able to save you, Carlo, or I'm sorry for treating you the way I did. Yeah, I'm so glad I didn't pick this. Holy shit. That would have been so bad. Would have missed out on the whole ass fight. And also, I wouldn't be satisfied. 
Oh, he's immediately alive. Did he just live happily ever after? Like, what? And also, a lot of things depend on what Sophia does. But that's like a side thing. He's still traveling around. Oh. Are we gonna see him? Oh, yeah, I mean, it's just gonna be the same. But you have the ha arm, though. What? This finally feels like family. Thank you for returning. Oh, I like that. That's fucking cool. Truly the future you wanted? Yeah, even she's like, uh, you've kind of fucked up and you're fucked in the head. I mean, I don't like it and don't want it, but I like the way that ending is. Yeah, that's really sick. All right, free from the puppet string. You fight and you smack. That's the one I got. What's the other one then? Oh, that's with the extra stuff. Yeah, I got the best ending. Let's fucking go. No tutorials needed. Paracelsus. So this ending is just, oh, your dad's dead. All right. <laughs> I am very pleased. And we read that. All right, I did some very, very quick research here and looked up Paracelsus. I heard the name before, but he was a Swiss physician, alchemist, and philosopher. And he was the first person to introduce the use of chemical substances, such as minerals, into medicine. And with a conversation they just had on the phone or whatever, and even saying like crut experiment and needing to retrieve the arm, it seems like we're going to have like a whole series based on these fairy tales and them all being in the same universe. So like they have all the pieces of this weird mind or whatever this alien thing is that they use the arm for. And if the arm is that powerful, where's the rest of that bastard? Is that in Wizard of Oz land? I never watched Wizard of Oz. Like, I don't know anything about it. Wasn't a thing here in Denmark when I grew up, so I'm very unfamiliar with it. But maybe I can learn it through them making a game about it. All I know about it is, like, all the fucked up shit that happened on set, allegedly. Like, that's all I know. But yeah, the whole Paracelsus thing there, it's obviously, like, the higher up. They've chosen these historical figures to create a cool-ass fucking world. And I really want more of this universe. They also mentioned there are many forms of eternal life. So Paracelsus and them obviously have a much higher understanding of all this, but they're trying to experiment with things. And the entire story of Laza P was just one big experiment. To see what happens, I guess. So that's fucking cool. All we've heard about the outside world of Krat has been the East. Mentions of stuff from the East, as well as the song. Other than that, we don't really know much about what could be out there. So two kilometers north, there could be a goddamn Wizard of Oz simulation place. Like who knows? The most interesting line though is when they say another key of ours referring to her dorothy just imagine they follow this up with like a wizard of Oz style game like this right and then the final boss is just pinocchio actually infinite possibility and this could become one of the coolest fucking things ever all right back to my final thoughts on the game all right well time to do a little review here at the end i've pretty much said most of what i've wanted to say throughout the series and yeah towards the end but man this is genuinely one of the best souls like games that isn't a FromSoft game i've ever played in my entire life. I'm not even joking when I say this. If I had to put this in a tier list with FromSoft games, I would put this above Dark Souls. 1, 2, and 3. Like, it, I am genuinely that in love with this game. It has time on its side, of course. Uh, the combat just feels so nice. It's so refined, so optimized. Music is actually godlike. Boss design, story, lore, all of it. That It's got everything a Souls like needs. Plus, of course, the way it's based on Pinocchio and the whole spin on it. And it's just such a pleasure to go through. I don't know what kind of man Carla was, but judging from the original story in the books and not the Disney version, he would have probably appreciated the fuck out of this. This game is without a doubt getting in the top three games I've played this year, and this year we have played an insane amount of amazing games. It's been a while since I've finished a game like this and felt like kind of empty afterwards. And I, I have that feeling right now because it hits you emotionally while also just being a fantastic game. And it doesn't happen often anymore. You know, I've played so many games, seen a lot of shows, movies, whatever, and a lot of it is predictable and you know, you expect certain things. But sometimes you come across something that's just so well written and put together that it just hits. And this did in every single department. I love this game. So of course, check this game out yourself. I also gotta give props to the voice actors. They did so, so well. As well as when it's someone who's not the most famous voice actor, so you don't recognize them, it's like, it feels like it's that character. A lot of time you hear someone you've heard a lot before and it's like, oh, it's that guy. But when it's someone fresh and someone who's just really talented, it's like, Holy shit, that's like the character in the game that's talking. That's not the, the guy in real life. And for me, that's very immersive. So good job to everyone who worked on this. I think I'd give this game an easy like 9.5 out of 10. It's up there and I think it's joining in my favorite games ever. That's how genuinely good I think this game is. Of course, as any Souls-like, it's not for everyone. That is a given. But this one hit like 
everything for me. I like a lot of different things, so that might help. But just the way it was dark, emotional, extremely beautiful while being gory. Had a storyline with actually interesting side characters and side stories. An immersive world and lore. And there's still DLC to come, as well as possibly other games in the same world. So I'm more than hyped. And if you made it this far, thank you so much for watching the series. It's been a blast. And I cannot wait to return to this game once DLC drops. Thanks for all the likes and comments. And I just really appreciate you being here. And I hope you'll stick around, because we've got a lot coming. You know, a daily upload. So you can see me again tomorrow or anytime in the future if you want. I'll be uploading my Japan slash Korea vlog soon. Which took a long time to edit, so I hope you'll check that out. It's really, yeah, I'm really proud of it. Otherwise, you know, we're going to be playing a lot of other games. So just feel free to come hang out or maybe suggest things in the comments. And, uh, you know, leave a like on this video. <coughs> but yes, that's it. I love this game. I love you guys. Of course, subscribe if you're new around here. And as always, my name is Smith. And thanks for watching.